We're here with another Seminole newcomer, Danny De La Calle, a junior catcher. Where are you from, Danny? I'm from Cuba. Cuba. Yes, I was live. I lived in. Um, I've been living in Miami since 1996, so it's been what 20, 20 years. 20 years since yeah. you've been here. Mm -hmm. Awesome. What is your favorite professional baseball team? Um, I'd have to say the Texas Rangers. Yeah. Why? Um, I mean, it's just. It's like, I mean, it feels like Florida State is a traditional uh, American team. Yeah. You know I mean, just the colors, just bring them out. Just someone you've always kind of liked? Yes. It's, I mean, it's, it's great. <laughs> awesome. Why did you choose to play baseball at Florida State? Um, coming out of JUCO, I didn't have uh, too many options. Okay. Um, uh, but then uh, my sophomore year, um, I, you know, I was fortunate enough to get drafted by the Texas Rangers. Um, and then uh, Florida State came, and I mean, I kind of, um, I had to make a decision and then at that point, and I felt that coming to Florida State would be the best uh, decision to make. One of the biggest decisions of your life? Absolutely, definitely. I bet. If that, is the, that was the biggest decision I had to make. Okay. <laughs> at this point. I bet. Where were you when FSU won the BCS National Championship? I was in my home. In <laughs> I, your was home? Wa I was watching it with some of the guys uh, at my house. Um, it was it was awesome. Uh, Were you going crazy? Yes, it was crazy. It was it was. I had a blast. That's, That's awesome. The, I haven't haven't had an experience um, like that in a while. One to remember, right? Yes. Awesome. Why do baseball players chew sunflower seeds? I have to ask. Um, I guess just to get the nerves out. Um, you, you just like anybody who chews gum or sunflower seeds. Uh, sunflower seeds gives you something to do while you know. In the, in the intense game that's going on, um, it's it's just something that's tradition again. <laughs> of course. What kind of music do you prefer for your walk-up song? Uh, house music. House music. Yes. Uh, I I like um, all types of genres of music, but I'm really into house music, and it's something that gets me pumped up for the game. Do you, mm -hmm. do you try and get yourself pumped up, or the or the fans? Uh, both. Yeah. But mostly, you know, mostly myself, <laughs> just to get, you know, into the game. Right. Who is the most influential person in your life? Um, my father. He's, um, he, uh, he's been the most influential in my life. He, um, he got, uh, he was just, he got disabled. Um, he's uh, legally blind. Um, and that's really, you know, driven me uh, a lot, just to, just to see him happy and to see my family happy. Awesome. Yeah. What is your ideal teammate like? Um, some guy that has some, some someone that has your back uh, and just um, sees uh, sees you doing good, and then he can um, see the difference of like you know when you do bad, and can tell you oh, look, he brings you back up, and uh, this is what you're doing wrong because he knows how you are, you know, mm -hmm. and uh, just basic someone that's you know just helping you out. You like constructive criticism? Yes, yes, definitely. That's good, teammate. Yeah. Awesome. What are your expectations for the upcoming baseball season? Big. Um, I haven't been in a team like this since I've been playing baseball. This team is something else. I feel it. Um, I'm not the only one. I've been talking to the guys and the coaches, and we all feel that you know this team is is, is a very good team, and hopefully you know, we're fortunate this year to make it to Omaha. 